I'm learning at the same time as my daughter is. And then when we're going home, we talk about every single thing that she does at nursery. Um, when they get to about two and a half, they tend to need more children to play with, to learn. She's going to be used to having other children around her, sharing, uh, considering other people's feelings, interacting with adults. It's really scary if you're a little child and there's other big adults around. Bringing him out to the centre here gives us a great opportunity to develop his social skills uh, for him to play with toys that we wouldn't necessarily have at home, outdoor toys and things like that, and to see, meet other children. He generally has a lot of fun and with his learning. He's not faced by noise, children running around him, and he's quite happy to have other people pick him up. He's not, they're not isolated anymore, which has helped him quite a lot. The key worker for my, my son, she's been, you know, helping because she knows my son is a bit quiet. She tried to find out what, what he likes. They're really good. I can have a chat with uh, the key worker for Safa, what type of place she's doing, and then I can do similar things at home with her. There's no point of sending your child to a nursery. If you just bring them in the morning, drop them off, take them home, don't talk to them about it. What do you know what your child's learning? The nursery talk to, to me and they explain that this is what we're doing, these are the activities we're doing um, and if you can like keep talking about it, interacting, doing different activities at home, supporting his language, it's just giving him that extra boost. When I had my second child as well, I was at that point uh, we were struggling with childcare and it was like they kept him in and they were very supportive um, in, that, in that area as well so it was really good, yeah, part of the family.